Hello, welcome to Tina's Easy, Fast, Simple, and Delicious K Diner. Today, we're gonna make japaguri. Japaguri is combination of words that japagetti plus noguri. Uh, we're gonna mix it together and we're gonna make brand new ramen. Have you seen the movie Parasite? I'm not spoiling that movie at this moment. That they won a, a what do you call it? Cannes Film Festival, they won Palm d'Or, the, the best winner uh, in that film festival. Anyways, I saw the movie, and in the movie, they were making this japaguri, but in English, they couldn't find it. The Dossie Perkett translated that movie to English, to um, Korean to English, but he made a new word, ladong. So you, when you see the movie Parasite, you will hear ladong, that's japaguri in Korean. The difference between regular japaguri and the parasite movie parasite japaguri is we are making we're putting Korean beef. So we're gonna make japaguri today. Ready? We're gonna use one naguri, one japaguri. First of all, we need to boil the water. While we're uh, waiting for boiling. We're gonna prepare the beef, Korean cow. See the marbles? Looks so delicious, right? Korean beef is very famous. And it's very expensive. Even in local, in Korea, it's so expensive. We're gonna cut it bite size, but quite big. Because this type of good meat, if you chop it too much, you cannot feel the real taste of so like this size. Korean people call it gakdok sorgi. Every time we use meat, we need to put a little bit of salt. and the black pepper. Inside of the naguri, they have fake and the powder and this is seaweed. So we put in here. And inside of japagetti, we have fake and the powder and we have olive oil. So we're gonna use it all later. Oil. And I'm gonna put the meat. Just itself will taste fantastic, but I know, we are mixing very expensive beef with the one dollar instant noodle. But you know, a lot of Korean people, when they eating lobster, lobster restaurant, after they finish their own lobster, they are making lobster uh, instant noodle too. So instant noodle is very close to our daily life. and dried flake, there were two. So I'm gonna put it all in here. A very important point here is that this japagetti powder, we're gonna use 100%. But noguri powder, we're using only 70%, like two thirds. So we use like this much only, okay? If you put all, it's too salty and too spicy. So just remember, that's the perfect portion of making good japaguri. 100% and 75%. The water is boiling, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the noodles. Thank <laughs> you. 
You want to see the half cut of this? Perfectly. And we're going to cook a bit more so it will be like perfect medium. So naguri, the noodle, is a little bit thicker than the regular noodles because it's uh, supposed to be udong taste. So it's almost ready, so I'm going to turn on the heat, getting ready for the next level. And very low heat. So we're going to put the noodles here. And a little, little bit of water. And as I said, 100% of this powder, tapagati. And so I'm going to hold this like this. So I still have this much inside. And also a little bit of olive oil here. The mix. That's crazy. I know, it's the best japaguri ever in my life. See, it's a perfect portion of the soup and the noodle. I think this is it. Let me get the bowls for this japaguri. So it's like a spaghetti. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And one more here. So, are we ready to eat? It looks so delicious. I want to eat the meat first, but you know, I already know the meat will be killing every other uh, taste. So, I'm going to try the noodle first. I can smell the beef in here because we use the pan that we cook for meat. And now, <laughs> everybody's favorite cannot be bad because you know really good ingredients. You know, with the beef and the instant noodle, it's good match. Usually, instant noodle. We enjoy the flavor itself. And Korean people invented mixing with japagetti and nagri. We made a combination. So that's like a 
you know, new instant noodle for us. But in the movie, they use it, they used very expensive Korean beef there. So today, the movie was very hot issue. So I copied them, I followed them, their recipe, and you know, it was so good. <laughs> if you wanna see, if you wanna try the japaguri, try. And without beef, it's fine. And nobody's like, you know, nobody's putting $30, $40 steak in the instant noodle. But at the movie, they did. They were showing like a high, high class people. So, you know, with $30, $31, you can, act, you can feel like Korean high class people's life, maybe. <laughs> okay, this is it for today. And next time, I will bring more fantastic and dynamic food. Okay, bye.